Hello everybody, my name is David, your PDX Mopar guy, Morrow, down here at Ron Tonkin Ram. Behind me, I have a 2019 Ram 3500 Longhorn Edition. This is a great example of why this is the leading truck, heavy duty truck, and even for the 1500, same design. But uh, let me give you a nice little walk around to show you why, if you're looking for a dually or uh, just a heavy duty truck, why you should buy a Ram. So let's start from the side here. Just Look how pretty this is. And I'm gonna show you my favorite thing about this little tiny thing. I love the Longhorn badge right there. That is really, really pretty. I like that stamp that we have. I mean, look at the side here, nice and pretty. This is all nice and black, as you can see. You got the Rodian tires. They moved the uh, 3500 badge up here on top of the, uh, the hood. So it gives it a little sleeker and a little meaner design. If you look on top there, Right there, you're gonna have those clearance lights for the heavy duty. But look at this front. Look how luxurious this is. This is the top of the line, or close to the top of the line of the Ram trucks. You know, the one thing I really like, got these nice new headlights right here, the LED Ram lights. And look at the detail right here, in case you're wondering what kind of truck you're driving, you're driving a Ram truck. Nice LED, this, these lights at night are very, very bright. Look at nice chrome grill here with the Ram on it very beautiful and of course if you look down here i'm just a point right there you got your tow hooks and most important because this truck is kind of a beast if you look right here you got sensors all around this uh the side here and essentially what that does is they're parking sensors make sure that uh, when you're pulling in you're not gonna hit anything or backing out and then of course under the hood you're gonna have the the diesel engine this has the high output so it has a thousand Feet of torque on this. This thing will tow anything you want, just about. Very, very heavy duty. Look at these nice rims here. Very, very beautiful. I'm gonna take you inside here in a second, but I'm just give you a quick walk around. Back here, you got the dualies. This thing will haul tons and tons of stuff. I'm not gonna give you all the specs because it changes, but you know, this truck can haul easily 30,000 pounds. Look at the back here, you got the nice Longhorn grill, a uh, Longhorn uh, stamp back here with the big Ram emblem. And if I look back here, this one is all set up for your fifth wheel towing. I don't know if you can see it. I'm going to bring the tailgate down. Look at this. Look how nice and damper that is. Really nice. But I'm kind of in the shade, but you can see that you have the fifth wheel towing right here. All prepped up. Look at that. You got the electricity right there. And of course, you got the built-in spray bed liner. So very durable. Your nice new truck is not going to get damaged. If you look back here, right there, that's going to be your rear cargo camera. So you can uh, see exactly how um, your cargo is doing, the fifth wheel is hooked up or anything back here. And then, of course, you're going to have your backup camera right here. Let's look at your hitch. And, of course, you're going to have different types of towing right there for your your four prong and your seven prong trailer brakes are like good stuff you're gonna have the rear window let the dog stick his uh, head out now here's one of my favorite parts they've, they finally came out with is I'm gonna open the front door here remember this is the Longhorn edition so it's gonna be your cowboy style look at that now you have retractable running boards so so nice and if you look in here it's a little dark but you have this nice, I'll call it cowhide or horse hide, whatever, the nice brown leather interior with real, real wood grain. This isn't faux, it's real good. Yeah, it's real and it's real good. Power everything. This is your uh, your ranch luxury truck. So if, you, if you're hauling horses or in the rodeo and you're going on those long trips, this is the vehicle you want for sure. Let me get inside here real quick and show you some stuff. So another thing I like about this truck, and this is why it's going to be truck of the year, or a big contender, is the radio here. I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. You notice that, uh, that's in my pocket. I was going to show you the key fob here. Well, maybe I can find it. There's the key fob right there, as you can see. You're going to have unlock, lock. You can push this, and the tailgate goes down. And then you have remote start, and then you have um, panic button. But what I'm going to show you real quick is this, you know, there's no key to turn on this. You just push the button right here. And 
and starts right up. Now, did you? I hope you guys heard that. This is such a quiet diesel. They have come a long ways in making diesels quiet. Real quick, the the dash and the and the steering wheel. Look at the wood grain steering wheel. Look how pretty this is. It's really beautiful. And you're gonna have your voice recognition right here, so you can talk to your car. You can make phone calls. You can do a lot of stuff. Um, and the, here, here's the tipper right here. Which of uh, besides us in Tesla, who has a screen this big? Look at this 12-inch screen. Look at that. That's my hand. Look at that navigation. I don't think you can get, ever get lost with that screen. And then of course, you know everything's push button. And you know what's really nice? I like about what Ram is doing is you can control the fan the old-fashioned way by going like this. Look at that. Look how nice that is. The volume, or you can go into the radio. Look at that. Here's some other cool, look at this, you can even tear it. Look at that. So you can put navigation on the bottom, media on top, let's put nav right there, look at that. There we go. And then you can switch it up front so you can have your radio there we go. Sorry about that. I'm not going to go over all this, but a lot of really cool stuff. Go back to navigation. There you go. You can control it like this if you wanted to. Or it'll go up here. You can do that. So a lot of uh, duplicate, either hard button or digital um, inputs for the radio and for the heater, which is super nice. Look at this. Backup camera, you don't have to be in reverse. Now this is something I want to show you, it's really cool, it's going to be really hard. You can see you have, right here you have different options here um, to view. So you got the backup camera here, you have the cargo camera right there, as you can see, and check this out. I don't know if you can see that, but that's actually cameras outside, so you can uh, actually look at, so on your mirrors, but you can actually look in your radio here and look at your trailer so you can see a lot easier. Instead of having to look back and forth like this, on um, one mirror there and one mirror over there, use your radio as a mirror so you can back up your trailer safely. How cool is that? Of course, you got heated seats, bending seats, hidden, heated steering wheel, and look at this. Look at that one of the first companies to do the 360 camera. How cool is that? So right here, you can see all around you. If I had a trailer or some cars here, I could see that. Really helpful when you're backing up this big beast of a truck. I really enjoy all this technology. And then you can um, have the steps go down if you want to, and then make them go up again. Really cool. And then down here, the simple stuff, you, you have your exhaust brake, so if you are going down a hill, you put your exhaust brake on and it kind of uh, slows you down so you ride your brakes. Tow haul mode, which basically shifts better when you're hauling. And then you got your parking sensors front and rear. So as you're parking, you'll have the beep, 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 beeps going on. Really, really nice. If you look real close, look at here, you got the really nice leather wrapped and stitched uh, dashboard here. Look at that, and the wood grain everywhere possible. Seats are super comfy, and you see that right there? I'm talking about that tag right there. You know what that means? That means it's real leather. Anytime you get a tag with um, Chrysler that comes with a car, it means it's real leather. This isn't no faux leather. And lots of room back there. Storage underneath the seat. You got a sunroof too. And of course you got all this stuff up here, which is you have your um, sunroof right there that opens up. You got your tilt, which tilts it. There we go. And then you got your rear window that opens up right there, if you can see that. So this is just a quick review. I, I want to show you this too. Look at this. Watch this. There's the mirrors right there. They actually go up. Ugh. I gotta go out here and do it. Ah, there we go. There, there's your towing mirrors. So check this out. 
you pull it into a narrow place and you know you don't have long arms to do it right there you just push that button and there it goes look at that power mirrors power folding mirrors really nice One thing that I wanted to make sure I want to show you guys is the uh, center console here. So check this out, what you got here. This is where you put your phone when you're driving. And what this does right here, if you have one of the phones, most newer phones have it, it charges it. So you can put your phone in here and it charges while you're driving. In addition, when you plug it into one of these right here, your phone will mirror to your radio. And so you'll be able to uh, use Google Maps or Waze or the text messages or a phone without having to pick it up, which is super nice. In addition, you have another charger right there. It's really kind of hard to see, but you have a charger, a three-prong charger there. And kind of a, a rare breed. How many cars have CD players? You don't know how many times I ask, I get asked, does that have a CD player? Yes, ma'am, it does. So you can play all your 80s and 90s CDs here, however you want. Lots of storage. I want to show this to you too. If you have any math stuff you want to learn, you have it right there. And then you have more storage that slides back and forth here. Like that. Sorry, I have it like that. There we go. So it slides back and forth. If you look really close there, this is kind of awkward, but you can see right there you got three, four generations of RAM. So. This pretty much has everything that you want and more. I don't know, uh, it's just too much to go over in a video. But uh, I hope uh, to show it to you in person and show you everything that this has to offer. If I ever get a truck, I would get this model. This is one of my favorite models. It's very equivalent to the Limited. Um, however, this is just more Western style, cowboy style, ranch style, however you want to uh, phrase it. Longhorn is the way to go if you're gonna be that urban cowboy. So my question to you guys is, one, would you buy this? Two, is there anything else you want me to show you on this vehicle? Um, there's a lot of options here from the radio to you know all the widgets and gadgets here on the, um, on the uh, radio here. But uh, if you guys have any questions, please uh, put in the comments and I'll do my best to respond and uh, highlight something. Uh, again, this is David Morrow, your PDX Mopar guy down here at Ron Tonkin. Uh, go ahead and uh, call me or text me, and uh, I'll show you any vehicle you like. Thank you so much. Have a great day, and I hope you enjoyed this.